On the FAF Ambition Essential Soy Machine, the reverse button can be used in two ways. Let me show you what I mean. So if you need to lock your stitch by stitching backwards and then stitching forward, you can engage it, but look what it does. See that little picture of the reverse button showing on your screen? That means that without me having to hold this button, it will sew backwards as long as it wants to go. Once I want to go forward, I need to touch that reverse button again, and that little light goes off. Now, a lot of you are used to touching and holding this button, and then when you release it, it goes, or hold it and it goes backwards, release it, goes forward again. But let me show you how you can do that too. When you're sewing and while you're sewing, needles going up, if you touch and hold that reverse button, now the machine will go backwards. If you release it, it goes forward. So here we go, back and forward, back and forward. But the key is, is if you touch it while you're stopped, that's when you get that, oh no, I'm going backwards without holding it. <laughs> and that picture comes on your screen. So just kind of keep in mind when you're touching it and how you like to sew. Because we all like to sew a little bit differently. You might like the fact that you don't have to hold that and you can engage it, have it sew backwards. And for the rest of us who just want to get a quick little locking stitch in, that's one way we can do it. Just keep sewing and hold it while we need it.